Grade 3 Math, Lesson 30, Multiplication Word Problems. When we did addition and subtraction word problems, we had clue words. Well, there's also clue words for multiplication word problems. Here's some of them. In the word problem, if you see the word times, multiplied by, product of, increased by, decreased by, factor of, in all, total, each, or doubled, tripled, quadrupled, then these are clue words that the word problem is going to be a multiplication problem. Let's look at one. Emma has three times more jelly beans than Sophia. If Sophia has four jelly beans, how many does Emma have? Sophia has four jelly beans. See the word times? That's a clue word. So we're going to do 4 times 3, or 3 times 4. If she has 4 jelly beans and Emma has 3 times more, 3 times 4 is 12. Sometimes if you draw a picture for the word problem, it'll help you. Let's try this one. The fish population increased by a factor of 5. If there were four fish, how many are there now? Factor of. Factor of is a clue word for a multiplication word problem. Factor of tells us to multiply. The five and the four. Four times five is 20. If there were four fish, and it increased by a factor of 5, these 4 would have more fish, right? Times 5, 20. Let's look at this one. There are two rows of flowers with 8 in each row. How many flower plants in all? Two rows of flowers with 8 in each row. See in all? That's our clue word. It could either be addition or it could be multiplication. You could add these up, but it's much quicker to multiply. So 2 times 8. 2 times 8 is 16. There's 16 flower plants in all. The number of birds at my bird feeder tripled this week. If there were seven last week, how many are there now? Tripled. That's a clue word that, it could, that it's multiplication. So, last week there were seven birds at my bird feeder, and now it's tripled. So, seven is very important. And the other second number, see how there's always two numbers in these problems, sometimes there could be three or four, but in these particular ones, we've only got two. So we need to find the number that we multiply by seven. It's right here. Tripled means times three. The number of birds went up times three. So if there was seven, we're going to do seven times three. Seven times three is 21. Now I have 21 birds at my bird feeder. That's a lot of birds at a bird feeder. So when you're doing multiplication word problems, look for these clue words to help you know to multiply. Draw a picture to help you answer the problem. Pictures can really help. See you next video.